Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the access denied error in Windows 11. So please follow the steps with me and let's get started. Okay, the first option is to make sure your account is placed as administrator. So to do that, press Windows key and R to open up run. And then you need to type in there, control user passwords to, and then just click OK. Once you open the user's accounts window, then in here make sure you select the account that you want to run it as administrator. And then after that, just click on properties. On the top, select this option, group membership. And then after that, make sure you select administrator. Then just click apply and OK. And the next method to try, go to the problematic folder, right click on it, select properties. And on the top, click on security and then advanced. Over here where it says change, just click on change and then in here type the name that you want to make it as administrator. So once you type the name, then just click OK. And you will notice the owner name changed in here. Also, you need to make sure at the bottom select this option, replace all child object permission. So once you select this one, just click on apply and then OK. And then next, go to your C drive. Click on this PC. And on your local C drive, just right click on it and select properties on the top click on security and then select edit in here we need to give full permissions so select all of them and then click on apply and ok the next option you can try is to enable the hidden administrator account so to do that just go to search bar and type in there cmd and make sure you open the command prompt as administrator you can type this command or copy and paste from the description below and then just press enter this will unlock the administrator account. So now you can log off your account and switch to the new account that you have enabled. Then you should be able to access your files. And once you're done using the administrator account, now you can open the command prompt again and use the same command in the description. Instead of yes at the end, you can just put no. Then this will take you back to the normal administrator account. Hopefully one of these methods will be useful for you. And that's all. Oh no, by the way, have you subscribed to my channel? If not, thanks for your support and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.